Hi everybody, do you feel lucky? Well, do you punk? From hand cannons that can kill a brown bear in one shot to bullets that move at up to 2300 feet per second, here are 10 of the most powerful pistols in the world. Ten, Smith & Wesson Model 460 XVR Magnum Smith & Wesson's 460 XVR revolver is so named because it's an extreme velocity revolver. It's estimated to hurl its gigantic .460 bullets at a crazy speed of around 2300 feet per second. Smith & Wesson say that this is the fastest that any bullet shot from a revolver currently in production can go, and it can take more rounds than just the .460 including the 45 and the 454 all in the same cylinder. Its design is also intimidating, just like all of the other Smith & Wesson guns on this list. It weighs around 72 ounces and has a barrel that's nearly 8.5 inches long, which helps to keep recoil low. It's meant for hunting big animals, and for that purpose you should also consider getting it a nice scope and stand. It really puts the power of this thing into perspective, and it's also just cool to hunt with a huge pistol more powerful than most rifles. 9. Pfeiffer Zaliska .600 Nitro Express the .600 Nitro Express is a round that was originally designed to hunt gigantic animals like bears and elephants. You'd think that you could only shoot this from a big gun, but naturally, some madmen decided to build a pistol that could shoot these rounds, and it's absurdly large. Austrian manufacturer Pfeiffer Zaliska made a pistol that shoots .600 rounds and it weighs almost 14 pounds and has a 13 inch barrel. Just look at this man holding one. However, because of its sheer size, there's not a ton of recoil. Its weight absorbs most of it. Given its weight, you can only really fire one of these while in a resting position, such as at a bench. Because of its absurd size and idiosyncratic cartridges, this is a very expensive gun costing around $17,000, but it could probably take out most bears in a single shot. So if you need a gun that can handle gigantic game, then this will do the trick. And now for a super classic, but first, if you are new here, be sure to hit that subscribe button and let me know your favorite pistol in the comments below. 8. Smith & Wesson Model 29 Smith & Wesson's Model 29 is the gun that Clint Eastwood used in Dirty Harry to take on criminal punks, so only use this handgun if you feel lucky. If there are any classics in the handgun arena, then the Model 29 is definitely one of them. In fact, it's so iconic that Smith & Wesson released a Model 29 classic that looks incredible incredibly iconic, but there's more to the Model 29 that you could find in a movie. It's a 44 Magnum revolver, making it one of the most powerful handguns in the entire world, falling only to .454 and .500 cartridges. The Model 29 has a carbon steel frame and a double action trigger system that makes shooting it feel easy, and with a 6.5 inch barrel, this gun can take out most anything that gets in its way. If ever there was a gun to define an era, it's this one. 7. 500 Linebaugh BFR The 500 Linebaugh is a type of handgun cartridge which can deliver a lot of power and energy when shot. When it came out in 1986, it was a revolution. So when Magnum Research, the same company that makes the Desert Eagle, announced their intention to make a big frame revolver, or BFR for short, the gun world was naturally excited. Up until 2019, most revolvers that could take 500 rounds were custom made, but not now. Magnum Research's BFR is built on a sturdy solid stainless steel frame and can hold 5 rounds at a time. At around 52 ounces when you hold the gun in your hand you can feel the weight, but that heaviness also means that their BFR is less inclined to massive amounts of recoil that might be generated by its powerful rounds. However, this high quality engineering comes at a cost, around $1300 to be exact. But if you're looking for a powerful revolver from a company you can trust, Magnum Research's BFR can't be beat. 6. Ruger Super Red Hawk The Ruger Super Red Hawk looks like a straight up classic western revolver, and that's because it pretty much is. It's a double action revolver which means that when you pull the trigger, the gun both cocks and lets go of the hammer, firing the gun. It can hold 5 or 6 rounds depending on the cylinder placed in the revolver. It also shoots a number of different types of bullets depending on the design like the 44, the 454, or even the 480. With a 5 round cylinder, this classic gun weighs around 53 ounces and has a 7.5 inch barrel, but like others on this list, this gun is so powerful that it's not usually meant to be used in the line of duty, but rather for hunting big animals. 
the .480 rounds have less recoil than the .454, so this gun can be used in a wide variety of hunting situations. Would you ever want to hunt with a Wild West revolver? Let me know down below. 5. CVA Optima V2 50 Cal Black Powder Pistol The CVA Optima V2 .50 Cal Black Powder Pistol looks like it was designed less for everyday use and more for ransacking other pirate ships on the high seas. Its long barrel and slender frame just scream swashbuckler, but the gun itself is nothing to shake a stick at. This is a single shot handgun with a break action loading mechanism and a whopping 14 inch barrel to boot. CVA also builds this thing with a bullet guiding muzzle system, which makes this pistol accurate even from ranges longer than typical rifles are capable of. Of course, if you're loading this gun a lot by opening it over and over again, you'll want to be able to do it quickly and CVA's quick release breech plug makes that easier than ever before. In fact, if you're ever having any trouble with it, you can remove it with your fingers alone. It also has a center of gravity trigger, which means that pulling the trigger is an incredible natural process, and at around $350, this powerful gun is on the cheaper side. So if you need something that'll take down game, you're in luck. Four. Thompson Center Encore Pro Hunter. The Thompson Center Encore Pro Hunter kind of looks like a rifle at first glance, but it's actually a big pistol. The similarities between it and a more traditional fully fledged rifle don't stop there. It's also a break action pistol, like the black powder pistol, meaning that once you've shot a round, it breaks open and you load it from there. It's also only meant to hold a single round, but because the barrel is 15 inches long, it's a big boy, weighing in at around 72 ounces. But it can take a few different kinds of rounds, like the 223 Remington or 308 Winchester rounds, and if you change the barrel up, you can load a few more different kinds of rounds, going all all the way up to a 50 cal. That makes this rifle-like pistol super versatile. The most notable feature of the Pro Hunter is that it's built on the so-called Encore frame, which combines Thompson Center's frame that they use for their contender single-shot pistol and rifle. The Pro Hunter is meant for hunting large animals like many of the other guns on this list, but the Pro Hunter really has the looks to back it up. Doesn't it look like something that you'd drape over your shoulder out on a hunt? It does to me. Have you ever shot the Pro Hunter before? Let me know in the comments below. Three. Desert Eagle Mark 19. The Desert Eagle Mark 19 shoots the largest pistol round out of every semi-automatic pistol on the market. That round is called the 50 AE, and those rounds have brought this Desert Eagle and its brethren into the spotlight. If you're ever watching TV or at the movies, you can bet you'll see one of these guns in action. Tomb Raider, Robocop, The Matrix, The Boondock Saints, every one of these include characters that use the Desert Eagle at one point or another, and the Mark 19 is the baddest Desert Eagle of them all. The Mark 19 is made by a company called Magnum Research, and it's really big. It has a barrel that's 6 inches long, a magazine that can hold 7 rounds, and to top all of that off, it weighs around 72 ounces. Most semi-automatic pistols use a particularly short recoil design to work, but not the Mark 19. Instead, it employs a piston system run by gas that is used more in semi-automatic rifles than it is in pistols. It's the same mechanism employed by an AK-47. This piston system also gives the Mark 19 an advantage over other guns similar in size. It significantly reduces recoil, which means that you can aim with greater accuracy even though you're shooting .50 caliber bullets, the biggest rounds of ammunition for a semi-auto handgun you can get at stores. Where have you seen the Desert Eagle used in movies? Let me know in the comments below. Two. Triple Action Thunder The Triple Action Thunder pistol shoots the same ammo as shot by snipers during the Iraqi war. At the time, the ammo was coming from sniper rifles, which we typically think of as more able to handle larger rounds, but the Thunder pistol packs the same amount of punch within a much tinier frame. Sadly, this gun isn't currently being manufactured because they can't find anyone to whom they can license the blueprint. It was originally designed by Yanosh Lakatos and produced by Triple Action LLC who hail from Logan, Utah. They showed this powerful gun off at the 2003 Shot Gun Exhibition, and then after that, it just vanished. That's a shame because it's one of the coolest guns I've ever seen. It's a single shot pistol for good reason. It shoots 50 BMG ammo, the same shot from 50 caliber sniper rifles. It weighs around 12 pounds and its barrel is almost 17 inches long. In order to reduce the monumental amount of recoil that shooting such huge ammo creates, Triple Action created something called a nitrogen recoil controller and a big muzzle brake on top of the barrel. You can make the gun lighter by about 1.5 pounds by trading 
getting that muzzle break for a porter. Given the ammo that this thing shoots, it's really a beast to be reckoned with. 1. Smith & Wesson .500 When you're thinking purely in terms of power, the Smith & Wesson 500 can't be beat. Most sources say that it's the most powerful handgun currently on the market, even though there are technically a few guns out there which are more powerful. There are a bunch of differently sized barrels that you can put on this thing, ranging from around 4 inches to a whopping 8.75 inches long. That might be kind of hard to manage, but if you're looking for power, it can't be beat. The S&W 500 is a double action revolver made by the famous gun manufacturer Smith & Wesson. It's made on their so-called X-Frame, which is basically just the biggest frame they've got. Because of its internal barrel sleeve, it's pretty easy and inexpensive to manufacture. This sleeve also gives the weapon greater accuracy. Made from solid stainless steel, it's mainly meant to hunt big animals like bears. The gun itself holds five pieces of ammo. It comes standard issue with a rubber holder that helps to reduce recoil. It also takes massive .500 magazine cartridges, which have only been around since 2003. At a weight grain of 300, this bad boy can go at 2,075 feet per second and inflict 2,868 feet per pound of damage. Talk about power. Have you ever seen a gun as powerful as this? At around $1,000, it's not terribly expensive either. Thank you all for watching. What is the coolest pistol on this list to you? Do you have one? Let me know in the comments below. And don't forget to like this video and click that notification bell to stay updated on all of our newest videos. See you again soon.